This song's from 1935. It was written by Harry Warren and Al Dubin from the movie Gold Diggers of 1935. It won an Academy Award. And interestingly enough, it was also used as um, background for a scene in another movie in 1935. That's hardly ever done. Usually they wait a couple years before they'll take an original song from one movie and stick it into another one. But in this case, the movie was called Secret Agents, or Betty Davis, and um, the idea was to use a contemporary song to create an ambience that was of that day, 1935. 1936, it was used in a Warner Brothers cartoon. And then it was used in many other movies over the years. 1951 was the title song for a movie that starred Gar's Day. My dad took me to see that movie. I was nine years old. And for some reason, that song stuck in my head. And, um, which is kind of odd for a nine-year-old kid to remember a song like this, but when I started doing these American songbook songs, I said, boy, that's got to be high on the priority list. Come on alone and listen to the lullaby of Broadway, the hip hooray and the ballyhoo, the lullaby of Broadway, the rumble of the subway train, the rattle Oh. 